Hello, my name is Tobias Mann, and in this video, we will be looking at setting up a Blogger photo blog. So, first step is to head over to blogger.com and sign into your Blogger account using your Gmail ID. Once you've signed in, it will ask you to register with Blogger. Enter your display name and check to receive email notifications and accept the terms of conditions. Click continue and you will be given the blogger dashboard. Now first off, dismiss any uh, notifications and click try new interface. It is quite a bit better than the old one. Again, dismiss any notifications and click new blog. The first step is to select a layout you like. I recommend the dynamic views view if you don't know what to pick. Enter a title and a URL. Sure, isn't one that is already taken. For this example, I will create my really cool photo blog. Once you've created your blog, you should make a post. Your, your first post can contain anything you want, but for the sake of this blog, we're going to just post a photo. So in the title, let's enter my first photo. Click back into the body of the page and click the import photo button. Click choose file and select the file you'd like to upload. I'm going to upload a photo of a sock monkey from a thrift store. Once it's imported, click Add to Post. Click on the image and select the size you want. Then under the image, you should type a short description of what it is and why you took the photo of it. Formatting the text is like in any word processor. Just select the text and select the formatting option you want. So I'm going to set the text as centered. Enter a few labels for the image. I'm going to enter sock monkey, photo blog, and photography. And then I'm going to set a location of where I shot the photo. Once I've completed that, I can click Publish. I now have my first image on my photo blog. Now let's take a look at the Stats section. The Stats section is nice because with a photo blog, you can see how many people are looking at your photos, which photos they're looking at, and where the people are looking at them from. Next, let's go down to Templates and click Customize on our theme. We can select a different layout to suit our needs. And we'll look at each one. Once you have a lot of images, I would recommend using the mosaic layout with the dynamic views blog. I do not recommend the sidebar option. For this example, I will use the snapshot look. Clicking advanced will allow you to set the fonts. I recommend you play around with the fonts and see which ones are going to work with your browser. Once you're completed, click Apply to Blog and click Back to Blogger or View Blog.
To view your blog at any time, click View Blog. There you have it. You've started your own photo blog. Clicking on the image can show you what it's going to look like and the effects it's going to have. There you have it. You now have your own blogger photo blog.